Hi everybody! Today we are going to be making a hurricane model out of our very own kitchen supplies. But before we jump into the model, let's talk about a few things that all hurricanes must have before they form. First, there has to be warm water in the ocean. Second, that warm water goes into the air and mixes with energy and heat. And third, a wind kicks it up and starts it spinning. So, we are super excited to make our own hurricanes today, and we hope that you'll grab some supplies and make one right along with us. The supplies are super easy. You probably have them in your kitchen. Let's take a look at what they are. All right, to get the hurricane started, we're going to spin our warm water in a circle with our stick. We'll stir it for about 10 or 15 seconds to get a nice spiral action. And then we will add the food coloring right in the very middle of the hurricane. And we'll give it a second, and you can actually see the way that the water is spinning with the hurricane. What about mine? Your part will be next. You can see it spiral out as it grows bigger and bigger. Is my turn yet? And next we're going to add the clouds. Why does it All right, good clouds, good clouds. Stop adding clouds, let's give it another spin why does it look pink? and see if we can get our clouds to spin in the hurricane too. Mom, why does it look pink? We talked about how from the sky, if you look on a satellite picture, you can see the satellite spinning clouds. Mommy, can I have some okay, and it looks so I can, just like can, this. Can I have some cutting? Do you cut it back? At this point, we're going to give everybody a stick because everybody loves to give the hurricane a stir. So yeah. anyone else who wants to reach in there and help out, go for it. Actually, I need, we need one more milk in. And that was how we made our hurricane model. I would love to know if you guys make one. Feel free to send me an email or tell us on Facebook, and we will talk to you later. Have a great day, and thanks for following along. Bye!